Don't you think it's different? Why is it different? What's the relevance? Well, remember what this V cross A is responsible for. It was a part of the formula for the curvature. Right? We needed to divide that by the speed to the power of 3 to get the curvature. So let me see the relation there. Well, the curvature is a parameter that does not depend on the speed. And of course, the curvature squared doesn't depend on the speed. <coughs> What that suggests is that that ratio doesn't depend on the speed. And we divide it by the numerator from geometric consideration and we divide it by denominator in physics consideration. So what it means is that if you divide this by well, the quantity we had, if you divide it by the square of the curvature, you will get speed to the power 6 cancelled and you will get exactly what we have here. So what we discovered was a quantity independent on, of the speed, but apparently that quantity contained not only geometric information about the curve, about its 3D nature. It contained something else. It contained some information about the curvature as well. So what we needed is we needed to extract that curvature information from there so that the remaining part is responsible for the torsion only. Right? In the same way as we did for the curvature, we needed to extract the geometry by dividing by that square of the speed. So what we needed is to divide by the square of the curvature to get that torsion. And that's exactly what we didn't get in physics. 